Today I'm going to be reviewing the TFL Comfort Glide Iron, product code FV2650. Now the first things I noticed about the iron is the size. Um, I've not quite had another iron quite as big as this. Um, I'm not sure if the video does it justice, but you can tell from here the tank is extra large, so it fills right up to the maximum line, which is there. Um, and it takes three of these to get it to that maximum fill. Now, the only negative I've got about the iron is that it doesn't come with one of these. Um, and luckily, I did have one from a previous iron and I didn't throw it away. Um, but this is a large jug, I would say, and it takes three of those to get it to the maximum fill. Now, the second thing I'm going to mention is the trigger for steam, which is underneath the iron, which is perfect for me as I've got small hands. And if the steam button is on the top, I do sometimes struggle to reach around to press the steam button. So with it being underneath, it's a much more comfortable iron um, and makes ironing a little bit more pleasurable. I mean, I say a little bit. Um, I'm sure there's not many people out there that do enjoy ironing. So the next thing I'm going to mention is the actual settings. So we've got minimum, which is right around there where my finger is. And then you've got delicates, wool, cotton, and then maximum. Um, I don't follow ironing rules. I do try, and um, I do try, I will be honest, I do try and follow. If something does look delicate, I will turn the iron down. But I am pretty much bog standing, and I try and stay in between, somewhere in between these. So it's not too hot, and I know I'm not going to ruin my clothes. The next thing I'm going to mention is the trigger here that you can see so you can turn the steam off some irons you can't do that so this is perfect you literally flick it if you want the steam to be on flick it if you want the steam to be off this is um, your water dispenser and that's your button for your water I will give it a little spray as you can see it's uh, coming out there and obviously this is the water tank that I mentioned before I'll just try and do it with this one hand it's quite tricky and um, you use the water jug to fill up the iron there. Now I have to say, um, this is possibly the best iron I've ever owned. I've usually gone for just bog standard supermarket irons in the past and they've been much smaller and um, not as powerful. Now I did all of my daughter's school uniform yesterday with this, which would usually take me 40 minutes. Um, and it was a breeze with this, literally 20 minutes I was done and everything was literally crease free. So I highly recommend it. I'm just trying to think if there's anything that I've missed. Um, if you'd like to know the wattage, the iron is 2,300 watts. It's got a steam turbo of 120 grams. I'm not really sure what that means. Um, it's anti-drip and it's got duralium technology. Um, which is obviously the back of the iron, which is this part. Um, and I assume that it makes ironing much easier, which it does. 